Hello and welcome to another review here at Total Toy Recon. So today we're doing a mail call review. We are unboxing something that we ordered. So recently, long story short, I ordered something from HorrorMerch.com. I had never ordered anything from them before and I saw this incredible Vincent Price t-shirt. Um, I was I was going to see Victoria Price, his daughter, at a, at a movie theater. She was going to do a talk about her father and... By coincidence, my son was also going to receive the name Vincent when he was born. So I thought, well, this is great. I'll have the shirt. I'll see her. And then my son my son will be born. I'll have this funny shirt that I'll, I'll wear in some of the pictures the day he's born that says Vincent. That'll be a thing. Ordered two shirts. One for me, one for my wife. They were made to order. My wife got her shirt in about three weeks. I did not get my shirt for 180 days later. Horror merch sent me a notification that the shirt was not going to be made. They offered me a refund. I did not see this email to 240 days after I had ordered it. So eventually I ordered something. I went through their whole website trying to get stuff. Almost all their t-shirts are made to order. So I wasn't gonna go down that route again. So what did I order? Well, I'm a big fan of Super 7 action figures. And I really, really like um, the fact that Super 7 has gone and done reaction figures um, in the style of the old Kenner figures. So I thought that it would be fun to order a Super 7 figure um, from one of the Universal Monsters. Big fan uh, of, of just the series itself of these Super 7 figures. I have uh, a bunch of them when they were still Funko, but then I also have like the likes of Metropolis here. Very much, I, I picked up Maria because she's very much in the style of C-3PO. She's inspired C-3PO. I thought it'd be fun. And it's a little bit different. I do have a couple other weird ones. I have one from the Misfits. That's a Halloween one where it glows in the dark. I've got different stuff. I like it. I like the artwork. I like that you get the Fritz Lang artwork. Plus you get this action figure in the style of the old Kenner figures. So I thought I'm going to order one of the Super 7 Monster Universal Monsters. So let's open him up. See how they shipped him from Horror Merch. That's the point. I know that the figure is cool. The figure is awesome. But how did Horror Merch send the figure? So that's what we're looking at today. Let's open them up, and here we go. So I'm just going to open them up here, open them up here, open them up here. And obviously, uh, this side has my label and everything on it. So we'll just open this up and get a sense of what they did for the shipping. Excuse me. All right, so let's so open them up. No white paper, no you know bubble wrap. Uh, I mean not bubble wrap. No white packing, uh, white packing paper. No brown packing paper. And open them up here. And so we got the nice box. Um, this is kind of nice. It shows the, the human touch here. They added this, and then uh, so we'll unpack the bubble wrap. I'm slightly impressed actually. And we'll slide him out. And as you can see, I ordered the creature from the Black Lagoon. Um, as figures go, fantastic looking figure. Uh, if you're a fan of the old Star Wars days, you get a card that wasn't punched. Even better. That's a nice touch. And uh, the card is a little, you know, it's a little warped. Even just a little bit. I mean, not very much. Um, and as you can see... There's the, the dreaded words that one day I will do a, a story on collect them all and how that has shaped a, so many collectors my age. Collect them all. And what's nice is legally they have to, if they have collect them all and have them all in the box on the pack, they have to offer all of them right now. They cannot do that legally. Wave, wave one, wave two, wave three. When this came out, um, this figure was out like last week or brand new. You may not be able to get any of these. I believe I also have the Phantom of the Opera uh, in here somewhere. And another reason why I really, really like these is this artwork. I mean, you know, I can take him out. I can have fun with him. The artwork is very, very nice and very, very cool. So as shipping goes, I probably could have used a little packing paper in there. But this bubble wrap, nice touch. The human touch of making sure that it was sealed and, and stuck together, also very nice. So horror merch. Don't buy a shirt from them. You're probably not going to get it. Sorry, Harry Merch, but you're really disappointed in me. I had to wear my wife's shirt for all the photos. Um, and when I met Victoria Price, she loved the shirt, by the way. But 
She also probably licensed the shirt because she has the rights to her father's face. Um, but as far as getting an action figure from them, great A. So definitely recommend shopping at Horror Merch. They have Super 7 stuff. They have NECA. They have all the different Mezco monsters and things. Definitely want to check it out. This is Bob from Total Toy Recon. Thank you for listening to my review, for checking it out, and follow me on Instagram. I have all kinds of great um, uh, uh, toy announcements from different uh, companies, as well as retro finds, and I, you know, I do the toy hunts. So check them out. I always find weird stuff, and I like to repost other people's stuff that they find in different locations. Have a good day.